Hey guys, my name is George. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can track glyphs with Vigoras. I'm currently tracking glyph of Whirlwind and since I'm in my protection tree, uh, it's not visible because I don't have the glyph. But if I switch to my uh, Fury Talents where I actually have the glyph of Whirlwind, uh, you can see that it's gonna switch glyph equipped, so that works. The trick to that is to be using spell trigger and spell known. Before you click off this video, there are some caveats to that. First of all, you need to use exact spell match because if you don't, it's not going to be visible. So if I uncheck that and get out of Vikra, it's not going to be visible. Next sketch is actually in the ID itself. Uh, as you can see, if we go to the wow head and find Cliff of Whirlwind, the ID of the cliff is different. If you try to put the ID of the cliff there, uh, click OK. You can see that you cannot see anything because it doesn't work. Next step, OK, it's probably going to be the spell effect of that. So if we click on the spell effect and copy the ID of that, it's not going to work either. So uh, what's up with that? Well, uh, there's a trick to that because you need to use special ID. Uh, there's uh, this list here. It's basically a list of all the glyph spells. I'm going to put it in the description below so you can use it yourself. Uh, if I'm going to type whirlwind here and apply filter, uh, you can see that there's going to be glyph of whirlwind. And this ID should actually work. So I'm going to copy it. And if I'm going to paste it here, press OK. Uh, you can see that it works. And you can easily invert it that. So if I go to the not equipped, uh, you can see I, that I just check inverse. So basically this is it, how you can track uh, the glyphs. I hope it was helpful. If it was, you can press the like button, subscribe button, and you can watch more of my videos. And I'm going to see you there. Bye.